Do you like anime? Do you like t-shirts? Well, boy, have I got a surprise for you today. As the title of the video suggests, in front of us here is a selection of t-shirts, or rather a mystery bag of t-shirts from the website J-List. Those of you who don't know, J-List kind of sells Japanese products, basically, anime-related things, some adult-related things uh, that are usually related to anime, and, you know, other merchandise like plushies, snacks, and stuff like that. Anyway, they used to produce t-shirts. They don't anymore, and they've kind of put a stop to it. But, as a kind of way of commemorating their t-shirt printing and stuff, they put together some lucky mystery bag thing where you pay a price and they send you three random t-shirts in the size you want and stuff. So, I've gone ahead and bought a lucky bag of the men's variety. Now, obviously, I don't know what to expect exactly. Some of the t-shirts, well, all of the t-shirts are printed by J-List themselves. So these aren't going to be branded per se, even if they are a reference to something, they're not going to be, you know, official branding, they're going to be custom made for J-List themselves. Uh, I imagine there's probably going to be some Japanese text on them. I do have my tablet here with uh, Google Translate, which means I'll be able to run over the Japanese text to translate it, because if it's in kanji, I can't read that shit. Anyway, I've talked enough, let's go ahead and open it. Okay. I've opened it up. There are indeed some t-shirts here and there's a packaged item. Now, in the description it did say when you order this you do get a free item of something. I can't remember exactly. It was something like another t-shirt or a Totoro themed item? I'm not sure. Anyway, let's go ahead and look at the shirts first. So, I can feel each one. So, this one... Uh, ooh, okay. This seems to have some kind of magical girls on it or something. Let's open it up and have a look. Okay, so I'm back. Uh, I thought I'd lay it out and stuff. This is actually a Toho themed t-shirt. I was not expecting that. That's really cool. So it says here that it's Bad Apple and uh, describes exactly what Toho is. It's a series of, uh, you know, side-scrolling shooter games. One of them recently came to Steam, actually. I played the demo and Jesus Christ, it is hard. It is definitely a series that I'd love to get into, but I don't know if I could really put the dozens of hours. But as you can see here, that is Reimu, I think, is the name of the girl with red, the like shrine maiden person. Don't know the name of those two. But that is a really cool shirt. And on the back is that symbol, which means... Okay, jump cut. Uh, I tried using the app. It can't translate it, but I assume it translates to something like Bad Apple. Also on the side here, uh, the arm does indeed say this is a J-List shirt uh, from J-List. But yeah, that is pretty darn cool. I didn't expect anything quite that awesome. I expected some kind of like slightly off-brand or, you know, reference something, but uh, just straight up a Toho shirt. That's really cool. Let's delve into the next one. Oh man! Okay, I think uh, we can probably tell what that's going to be. I'm going to move this thing to one side. Also, I order these in large, but then realise that actually I'm ordering them from America, and large in America is actually larger than it is in the UK. So these are probably going to be extra large. And that is a tribal looking Totoro. Uh, is that a drill? I'm going to very quickly have a look uh, in detail at this t shirt. I'll be right back. Okay. I'm back. Uh, I've had a look. Is this a Mononoke reference? Now, I've never actually seen Princess Mononoke. It's one of the only Ghibli films, well, one of the famous ones that I've not actually seen. This is a darn good looking t-shirt though. It's kind of instantly recognisable to people who know what it is, but if not, it seems like it's just a weird anime creature or a weird creature in general. And of course, we have the J-list, um, I can't remember what her name was, Megumi, I think, is uh, the official mascot of J-List and that's to show that that is from this site. Yeah, so far pretty darn good t-shirt. So, third one, let's pull it out. Oh man, I think, <laughs> I think you can probably tell from this very small shot, but this is a Kill a Kill, Kill Bill reference crossover. That is pretty darn cool actually. Uh, I'm just going to move it slightly so it's more in focus. Okay, that is really darn cool. I love Kill Bill. I actually haven't seen Kill a Kill. Um, it is something that's definitely up my alley because it's by the people who made Gurren Lagann. And Gurren Lagann is definitely in my top five animes of all time. 
So I'm probably gonna give this a watch at some point anyway, but that is really cool. I really like the crossover. And again, this is the J-List themed one, so it's not an official Kill a Kill t-shirt or whatever. Although they probably got the license to have her on the t-shirt and presumably not the Kill Bill logo, but that is really darn cool. Anyway, it's time to delve in to see what the bonus item is. Oh man! It's a Totoro hat. That is really cool. I'm going to open that up and free it from his plastic prison. Okay, wow. So that is a, um, a cap of some kind that you can wear that has years and looks like a blue Totoro. I'm going to try it on. So this is the uh, hat on, as you can see. It's a little tiny bit small, I guess. If you were to turn this part up, it would be a little bit difficult. And also, I do usually wear glasses, uh, which means that hats usually look a little bit weird on me. But in terms of hats, that is actually really cool. And I am a sucker for kind of gimmicky hats that have ears and faces on them and stuff. So that's pretty darn cool. So, that about wraps it up for my lucky bag from J-List. Uh, this is actually a bag that came with it. I believe they're called Fukubukuro bags. Uh, if not, I'll put a subtitle correcting myself there. Oh man, in terms of t-shirts, kill, uh, kill a kill, kill Bill v thing's pretty cool. Totoro one is folded in half, is pretty darn cool. And Honestly, the Toho one is really cool because it's very slightly kind of a subtle reference. As in, if you don't know what the hell Toho is, it looks like you just got a bunch of anime witches on your shirt. Which really, let's face it, that's what Toho is. Also, uh, just an addition as well, while I was uh, emptying out the bag, I realised they also put a little sticker in here which says Merry Christmas 2017 or Merry Kurisumasu 2017. It's quite adorable and also features Megumi, their uh, mascot. Anyway, back to the video. Well, thanks for sticking around. If you did enjoy this video and would like to see more, I don't know, anime related stuff, maybe subscribe if you want and like the video if you like the video. And of course, leave a comment if you want to comment on anything. That's what the comment section's there for. Um, yeah, that's about it. I'll see you again.